about children make as a concept and method, I would really dare to say that uh, it really moves some boundaries. It is a project about democracy and about child rights, and it is about uh, creating spaces for children in the society to meet, to create, to share their own experiences, and also to discuss about very important issues like diversity, equality, sustainability, and some other issues. With the foundation in the Convention of the Rights of the Child, the Swedish Institute decided to develop Children Make in order to co-create a space where children could use art and technology as means of expression. We really take a standpoint in the Convention of the Rights of the Child where we use Article 12, the rights to participation, Article 13, the right of expression, and Article 31, the right to culture for a child. We think that this project puts emphasis on many different parts in the society everything from art actually being a human right for anybody and anyone and then making it in a playful way that is actually important for the child in his and her own development but also important for the society and how we see and what are uh, the, the skills that you need in order to take part fully in a society may it be democratically uh, or may it be um, as as a worker in the, in the future um, labour market. We have decided that it should not be Swedes running this by themselves, but we want this to be co-created with a team of artists, of makers, of programmers and of child rights uh, pedagogues. Our thoughts on the Children Make project uh, at the Interactive Institute is that we are interested in uh, working with research, design and innovation in the borders between child participation, the maker movement and how we can leverage knowledge in those areas into both the cultural and educational context. So uh, taking knowledge from one domain and lifting it into and over both country borders and cultural borders and mixing and getting uh, young people to see the force of both what you can do with creativity and with the tools of creation that are both analog and digital. We develop a, a set of cards uh, and those cards really represent uh, key ideas uh, that were really our guideline in developing this process. So for example, we have a set of value cards because this project is based on really concrete values such as equality, diversity, child rights, etc. What kind of tools we can offer to children and we also discuss how children can work on their stories. So we provided several cards about who can guide the process, how the story can be told. So we basically had two set of cards, one for children, that together with children, by using those kind of key ideas, we can go through the process from choosing the topic that you would like to deal with to create your own story, your own narrative, and then choose different kind of artistic and technological tools to tell that story. And on another hand, when we speak about local team, we use those value cards, those method cards, and also tool cards to see in what way we, as facilitators of that process, can work together with children. And what I would say that was advantage in this team was really that great mixture of different perspectives. We have three artists, we had a child, a child writer, we had composer or a sound artist, and we also had a visual artist. Also, we had a social worker, psychologist and pedagogue who really take care of the whole process. And also we had two technicians and programmers who really took care about the old technique. 
Mogu reći da iz perspektive programera i ljudi koji dolaze iz IT-a, Children Make projekat predstavlja veliki izazov, zato što se pod jedan prvo radi sa decom. Postoji ta bojazan kod nas uvijek da deca tog uzrasta od 9 do 11 godina možda nisu spremna da programiraju. Međutim, ovaj projekat me je demantao i to je bilo neko najveće, da kažem, otkriće do kog sam došao u ovom projektu. From the perspective of visual artist, I have to say that the project has a great potential. It includes two, from my point of view, crucial and most relevant aspects of contemporary visual art, dealing with important social issues and experimenting with uh, new technologies. For me it was the excitement of children as they were getting in touch with uh, the things we were working with and the kind of effect of surprise of what can be done with using these technologies. And also I was quite impressed by the ideas that they had, how to use them and how to utilize this knowledge and skills that in this like really brief period of time we uh, gave to them. What is also fascinating about um, Scratch and about this kind of programming is that it, it really mediates two worlds. It gives possibility to children and adults as well uh, to connect real physical world and uh, modern technologies. So it's not about that you just create in this technological environment. It's also a possibility that you connect the physical objects, the tools that you use every day with modern technologies and programming. So, for example, children could produce that by touching some physical object, there will be some interaction in the digital world. In Children Make, diversity was one of the main values. And it was evident in many levels. In one way, we really, together with children, try to create a space where all our differences can be our advantages and richness of different perspectives. So, what the life looks like, or how we play when we have disability, or when we live in different environments and different communities, when we have different background in a lot of aspects. So we wanted not to be members of different categories, but really to engage in the common issues and to use our different life stories and experiences as advantage and as a starting point for building mutual understanding. Our partner in this project was the Embassy of Sweden in Belgrade and uh, alongside with the work with children, uh, the Embassy used this opportunity to organize round table uh, related to Children Make program. And that was an opportunity to uh, engage uh, relevant stakeholders and also decision makers uh, in the field of uh, culture for and with children, in the field of education and also child rights. Maybe even children are a little bit more citizens than we are. They are the ones that are inheriting our planet, they are the ones that are still innocent when it comes to not destroying things and not breaching the rights that everyone is, is born with. So I can say that actually, maybe we should listen even a little bit more. I'm very happy that the project was organized in the cultural center of Belgrade because one of the main goals of our educational programs is to build the cultural institution which is relevant for future and for children as well. Pa najbolje je u ovom projektu što smo svi bili jedan uh, tim koji je uspao da napravi uh, neke stvari koje su nemoguće za decu, ali mi smo ipak uspeli. Razumijemo takve fantastične ljude za ovu kuću, nadamo se da smo dovoljno dobri i posticajni. Koji može da pomogne da se stvori s vami i žerati? I to je demokracija. Jedan taster, 
Drago mi je da su napravili ovakvu pričicu, posebno što su imali priliku da nešto novo saznaju, jer ovo koliko sam ja uspela da shvatim nešto što je sasvim novo na našim prostorima i prilika da deca ne samo kreiraju neku igricu, već da razmišljaju o tome zbog čega to rade i da izvuku pouke iz toga. Naučili smo o dječjim pravima, koje sve prava deca trebaju da imaju. Svidela mi se da ja sam ponija. Pa svidelo mi se to što sam naučio da može da se radi sa djecom koje su drugačije od tebe. Zato što smo upoznali nove prijatelje i zato što smo napravili jako zanimljive i poučne video igrice. Pa bilo je zanimljivo zato što smo pravili naše projekte i pričali smo razne zanimljive priče. Poruka ovog projekta je nekad i u lošoj situaciji moraš da shvataš da se držiš zajedno. Pa za mene je važno zato što je to bio me prvi nastup i mnogo mi se svidjelo zato što su svi bili odošli. Ja mislim da je oba naša igrica mnogo bolja od bilo koje napravljeno igrice na tabletu, računaru ili koje se prave u fabrici. Coming here to Belgrade and to the cultural center, exploring these technologies and seeing what goes on uh, in the mind of the child and in the group uh, and the organization has just been mind-blowing and it's fascinating to see how much creativity and learning that has been going on in such a short space of time. Uh, so I'm very optimistic that the knowledge contained within the team here in Serbia is, is really something to pick up on and use uh, in also a further context uh, in the coming years. Children made! 